All right, guys. So here, um, as you can see, I'm going to show you how to download the uh, trucks and tracks for rigs of rods, um, and that'll be in uh, the same video as this. Um, so uh, this website uh, is the primary source of where to get your trucks and or tracks. Um, it's called Sim Monsters. Um, there's going to be another link below the download link for the actual game it's, uh, sim monsters um, when you come to the page um, you'll have something like this so you're gonna have general and then this is all the forms you can look at all these different uh, things from like tutorials to requests and all that fun stuff but mainly um, first you want what I would do is create an account and then you can just create an account it's free it's better and then you just have to give your email and uh, best of all there are some I've noticed um, downloads that will show up only if you're a member and some that aren't so um, yeah that's uh, one of the nice things but anyway you can search through um, this even though we will be downloading uh, 4.5 rigs of rods this doesn't really matter it's just except for the tracks but um, all the trucks will work for each one. Um, the only thing is that um, the tracks have to be, um, oops, the tracks have to be uh, compa point four compatible, which means um, the point four point five uh, can be used for uh, the style of rigs of rods. But anyway, this is the site. Um, so now let's go into the actual download of the rigs of rods game. So, now I'm sorry about the uh, quality of the video, but I'm using Bandicam, and this one is just the easiest to use, but I'm sure it'll be fun. So, the first thing you want to do is go to this website. Um, like I said, it's in the first link in the bio, and then, so this is the download. Um, you won't, I don't think you'll need these, so when you get to this page, you first want to go to this where it says uh, 99 megabits, and then click this. Um, of course I have it downloaded so I'm not going to download it again but here it is and then once that uh, is finished you're going to double click on it and then it'll take you through the process of setting up and all the stuff you're just going to hit ok through the whole thing um, so now when you go into your documents and then or wherever you put the uh, file folder uh, I, I run uh, 0.4 and 0.38 as you guys can see so uh, if you open up the point four folder you can have um, all these things and we're going to primarily be using three which is packs terrains and vehicles so if you go into vehicles this is all your trucks um, if you go into terrains which is all your tracks and then don't worry about this uh, empty thing that's just going to be there won't do anything and if you go into your packs you can uh, access all your um, packs like the the SM uh, V4 pack um, which is actually here um, I'll have to put that in there and then there's all these uh, update things like the maximum destruction it doesn't uh, really matter for packs and trucks you can put trucks and packs and packs and trucks or vehicles sorry um, but you just want to put one of those in there instead of terrains so as you can see these are all my ones that'll work um, and then if you go into three uh, same thing with uh, 0.38 uh, it's, I just have a lot more trucks because I used to use that more so now uh, when we actually go into the sim monsters uh, website I'm using Google Chrome that's just um, the easiest and most reliable um, internet browser in my opinion so uh, we're gonna go I'm gonna download a truck they already have just to uh, show you guys Sorry about that. So if you want to download trucks, you can, you can go in here, but there's only 28, and then there's 835 trucks. So if you go to the downloads, and then you go to trucks, and then this is just a bunch of different stuff. And if you do download uh, 0.38, do not get this. This will mess it up. Um, I can show you how to fix the no tire thing if you are going to do that. But just go to V4 replica, and then you have all of these trucks you can see like um, Colton and Jared's Max D um, there's almost every single truck 
um, and Monster Jam is on here. You got Gas Monkey Garage, Max D, uh, Morgan Kane, um, Son of a Digger, Mad Scientist. So there's all these trucks, and then there are some custom trucks as well. Um, but say we want uh, to download, I don't know. Um, hmm, what do you want to download? I don't know. You guys pick. But what should we download? Um, and if there is not a truck that you see but you would like, um, just go into the forums over here. Oops, I'm sorry. Go into the forums up in the bar here and then go to uh, truck requests and then you can request a truck or a track or whatever. So um, we're going to go to El Toro Loco uh, Mark List. Um, there, all these creators are uh, amazing at creating trucks and whatnot. Um, uh, sorry, the internet's really bad where I am right now. But um, so usually it'll um, give credits um, for who the people, and then sometimes if there's a screenshot, then you can view the truck. Um, and if this will load, here we go. So here is the uh, download file link. And this should uh, take you to Mediafire.com, which is just where they, you know, uh, give you the links to the downloads. So once uh, you, you're going to hit uh, download once this loads, I'll be right back. So uh, now that this is loaded, just hit the download button, and then it's going to start over here. Again, my internet is really bad, so it's going to take forever to download. But uh, once this downloads, I'll show you what to do next. So now, um, once it downloads, it'll have, if you're using Google Chrome, you will have a download thing, uh, the bar you saw before. And then it'll have the zip for El Toro Loco Mark 2016. You're just going to click and hold and then drag that on your desktop. And then from here, um, if you want to open it up, uh, you have all these parts, there's materials, meshes, PNGs, wave, Sanskrit, um, truck files, so, and then I will be showing you this, how to edit trucks and then make them better, I guess you could say. That's uh, going to be in another video, but anyway, um, you're just going to click and then drag, oh wait, sorry, not yet. You're going to open up the folder for point four, go into vehicles, click and then drag and move into vehicles. I always just do it here this bar so it doesn't go into another truck file um, so now that it's in here we can go ahead and open up uh, rigs of rods and then you can see all these this configuration thing this is just your settings um, so the render system um, for when you just get it it will I think it'll be um, 800 by 600 that's more of a uh, square but then I usually choose uh, the widest or almost widest the uh, 1280 by 720 which is the 16 to 9 scale and then you can uh, use all these settings if you want I try not to mess with it that much um, if you go into here uh, replay mode that doesn't really need to be there but um, automatic shift that's just the easiest um, disable camera pitching out I, I like that and then arcade just click that um, so then you can hit uh, save and play if you're ready to go into the game and if not and you just want to save these but don't want to play it just hit save and exit and um, so yeah so let's open up the game uh, so just one quick thing uh, before you actually start the game um, an important thing to have is if you go to sim monsters go to the highest rated um, or the most downloaded go to the sim monsters v4 uh, pack so when you go to this it has basically every truck there is well there used to be and but it's in the most basic uh, fashion compared to what people make today so you're gonna have to first download this uh, some monsters v4 pack and then once you have that you're gonna uh, drag it again like you did with the El Toro Loco and then put it in your packs folder so once you do that then you can go ahead and open up Briggs of Rods. 
So now that you're at this window, um, there's all these different options. So the first thing that uh, I did was there's this enable uh, main music menu. It's just this random music. I turned it off. Um, you can see all of my things I'm looking at here. So I'm just gonna hit save and then hit uh, single player, and then we're gonna you're gonna have um, just two. Uh, or maybe I don't even know if there's gonna be any with this uh, terrains. But first, I would just download um, a point four track. So I'm, for example, I'm just gonna use Arlington uh, 2015. Click it um, and hit OK. Now I'm just gonna show you is I have a lot of trucks but see you can see all these you know trucks um, so first you're gonna want uh, to load this is very important load a um, truck from the SMV4 some monsters v4 pack um, if not the trucks won't load properly or they'll have white stuff or whatever so for, I was just do son of a digger uh, make sure it's the plane um, set up digger with this, make sure it's not like 2016 or anything. So we're just going to hit enter or hit OK and make sure it's from the SMV4. Hit OK. So now this will be here. Um, let me just turn that off. So to move your guy around, um, just use the keypad uh, forward, backward. You can also use W, A, S, D. Um, so you can also change the view view by hitting C, um, first person, third person, behind. So you can see it's very basic. Uh, to get in the truck, hit enter. And then to start it, you're just going to uh, hit X and then S, which is your starter. And then in this one, you, to go forward, you hit the forward key. And then to break and then go backwards, hit the reverse key can see all the things down here and then it'll shift automatically and then steering the oh, this is uh, important and then hit U to make this disappear and then the front steering only is the uh, left and right key the rear steering I'm sure you can change this but the rear steering is F1 and F2 it's to the very uh, top of the keyboard um, so you know you can do all different combinations so if you want to do donuts, you just hold F1 and then the left key. Or if you want to walk it this way. Um, and then, so say we want to go to this view, the cab. And then here's another view they can use. Um, that's weird. But say you roll over, um, you can either do two things. You can click and then drag the truck over, which is annoying. Oh, or you can hit delete or backspace, and then that'll just shut and then set the car. But if you hit I, then it'll load it back again. Um, so that's it. And if you want to shut it off, just hit X, and then you can't do the rear steering or anything. And then hit enter to get out, and then. Say your truck is moving and you want it to stop right here, just hit P for park. Um, N is the lights and that's different. Uh, now if you use the keypad on the um, right side, like the 7, 8, 9, 5, 4, 3, 2, all that stuff. Um, 4 is to move around, uh, same with 6. 2 is down, 8 is up, 7 is to set it so you can get closer. And then 9, this isn't permanent, but to zoom in, 3 is to zoom out, 1 is a front view, and then if you hit 5, it'll bring it back to normal. Um, so that's uh, all the basic stuff that you're going to need to know. Now, uh, once you have this loaded, uh, I would shut it off, and then you can just hit uh, enter again, and then walk to space, uh, and then get new... Uh, simulation get new vehicle and then uh, you can see we have all of these trucks but we're just going to do the uh, mark uh, you can see there's a body list and a 2016 hit enter because this is the one we downloaded
but here you can see it loads and then this is a much more detailed uh, version of what the truck is um, and the Briggs of Roz is virus free I've had it for uh, almost a year now and it's been great um, so same controls it might shut off and then if uh, if it does just hit X and S or if you have this open uh, if you hit uh, X you can see the battery in the engine and then hit S and then this will disappear but if you really want a simpler way just hit uh, and you're all shut off hit X and then the forward key and then I'll start it right up um, and you have all these views um, so sadly there's no smoke I know but um, so yeah that's the basic loading of a truck so like I said you always want to load a uh, SMV4 uh, truck first hit enter X to shut it off so it turns off the sound and you go into VP and then as you can see now the uh, truck has the drive shaft and it's all textured and it's not white um, most of the time you'll see like these uh, the knuckles these are called knuckles um, for the trucks um, these will have dot white dots those are the um, hooked knuckle bolts that are missing um, again as you do this more and more and you fix more trucks you will learn what the parts are called um, a lot of the a lot of them use the same um, drive shafts or um, axles or tie rods or uh, shocks or sway bars and whatnot so um, yeah so uh, this is the uh, how to load a truck a track is uh, you already know how to do that uh, so then there will be a, a separate video on how to um, edit truck files and change them around and that kind of stuff so look out for that video and uh, for now I'll see you guys later now so uh, say you run into the problem of there's no uh, part as you can see the drive shaft isn't there uh, you can see the ends but there is no drive shaft um, either this will happen or there is uh, the, part the, the part of the truck is white um, there is a way to fix this problem uh, as you can see this is VP Racing Fuels Mad Scientist um, I did change the round a little with like the eyes since they were red and they were they're supposed to be blue but say this happens again like uh, some of the trucks that you will download they won't have all the uh, parts or the files that you'll need um, so say sometimes the, uh, the shocks will turn out white that just means that isn't uh, textured or uh, something like that so say as you can see here uh, it doesn't have the drive shaft so we're gonna what we're gonna do is we're gonna hit exit uh, quit to desktop